I definitely have a lot of good feelings. I'm excited about this year. The team's excited about it. Uh, everybody around the city of Starkville is, so it'll be an exciting year. What's your first experience like this? What's it been like? Uh, it's fun. Uh, it's not as bad or as nerve-wracking as people made it seem, but uh, it's fun. When you faced SEC defenses, talking to a bunch of us, can't be that challenging. No, not at all. You're a lot smaller. When you, you talk about the, you know, the expectations, you see the people around here and the expectations around the program. I mean, how how much does that kind of fall on you as the leader, the kind of the quarterback of the team? Uh, we have ex there's expectations outside of the uh, the room, but we have expectations within the facility, and uh, those expectations I believe are a lot higher than anybody else's. And uh, we just want to get better, know the team that we can be, and uh, just go from there. Nick, what do you like about the offense that you run? Uh, it's a spread offense. I mean, we run it just as much as we throw it, or you really don't know what's coming up each and every play, and uh, there's a lot of diversity, and it's, uh, it's an explosive offense. Would it suit your game? Do you feel like perfect game? Oh, yeah, definitely. I mean, that was one of the reasons for going to Mississippi State and playing for Coach Dan Mullen, because I know what he's done in the past and the style of offense that he plays with. So, uh, How much has he tweaked it in the last couple of years? Uh, it's, it's tweaks here and there, but it's nothing just outside of the framework of what he's norm, uh, used to doing or the normal uh, Coach Mullins offense. You're a spread offense, but you guys have a really good power running game. What is it about the spread that lets you guys still you know, pound the ball between the tackles? Uh, because we, we have the guys spread out. I mean, we have four wide, and we have uh, the defense spread out, worried about the pass, but we have some a powerful backfield. I mean, with the quarterback run and the receiver, I mean, uh, bringing the receiver in and allowing them to run and just giving it to the running back and allowing them to go straight downhill, it's just, it, it stretches the defense, and they don't know what to expect.